Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Love Readings for the Aquarian Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign. I want to say thank you for being here, thank you for being back. I'm going to call in the Angels of Love and all the Universal Angels to come in. Um, I want to say thank you so much for your support, likes, and share, you Aquarians. And I'm asking you guys to leave a message, share these videos. It is so important that these videos are shared um, so that other people will receive the message. Okay, so my hair is a little bit not uh, wet, but it's okay. All right, you Aquarians. So we're going to be looking at the Aquarians for the month of June, love reading. Um, please like share these videos cross watch to find out what's going on in your partner's life um, cross watch also if you have situations um, cross watch also if you have um, situations coming up um, if you are single cross watch also this is going to be helping a lot okay a lot a lot a lot i'm seeing for the singles out there this is a message that just came in for the singles out there um if you're single and looking for someone there's new love that is coming in for you aquarians okay ace of cups new love is definitely coming in for you aquarians if you're out and about looking for a love relationship in um this month of june it's going to definitely happen for you guys okay some of you have to make the decision because you're seeing two people and you have to make a decision and choose for one person but nonetheless my hair is so wet but nonetheless um, if you're single looking for someone there is definitely um, definitely um, help that is coming in okay so um let's look at the aquarium readings remember these are free readings i don't have an extended tail so let's see what's coming in for the aquarium in uh, the month we have a um, situation with family that is coming up um, um then we have the situations with the red ear the blonde these are um young women okay then we have um, short-term relationship. So um, what is transpiring is that some of you, you could have a family um, or you have met someone, but it's not going to be long-term, it's gonna be short-term. So be aware of this situation. Then we have the dating queens who are in real short-term relationship. I'm seeing a lot of you texting, a lot of you texting, um, there is definitely some control issues that is going on with some of you. A lot of texts to find out. So I'm seeing um, the young women having some control issues, um, connection with people from past life. Um, some of you have long distance relationship. I see a lot of passion going on in relationship for some of you guys. I'm seeing friendship being made and the last is you ladies are standing in relationship um, where you're making a friendship now there is definitely a union that is coming in between you and someone so a lot of you could be receiving the ends in marriage because I'm seeing friendship so a lot of you could be um, receiving the ends in marriage so be aware of this okay so um, a friendship bond is going to be created there is really going to be a friendship bond but it's also going to be a bond of long term this is a union that is going to be building between two people and this is going to be a very very powerful union so expect this um to occur in this month okay so um this is definitely a wonderful message so there is a union so you um blonde ladies could be connecting with someone from a past life you could be getting married um this person is a definitely definitely true love and remember what i said about 
um, the single so if you're single and looking this month definitely it's going to be happy <laughs> oh my god I'm having so much energy coming out so um, for single people there's definitely going to be a new start for the singles definitely a new start I'm seeing have faith and hope because it's going to be happening for you guys so definitely have faith and hope with whatever the situation is because it's definitely going to be happening so let's just see what is um, transpiring we have some of you kind of give up open a situation whatever the situation is you have given up hope on the relationship or situation um, and this is because it's a love breed and you're giving up hope some of you could be given up hope on a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn okay and then the energy of the the energy of the Emperor is here and this is a situation where some of you are walking away from um, a marriage that could have power um, you're hoping up yourself um, you're trying to find the truth about a relationship why it didn't work and you have uh, and is dealing with this knight of pentacles some of you were in a relationship with the knight of pentacles a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and whatever the situation is uh, it was not a healthy situation and now you're seeing it for yourself and you decided to walk away so there is really a lot of reverse um, situation that is coming up which we are definitely 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 going to be looking at the how comes is that some of you could be really um, standing um, and holding yourself off from either marriage or situation um, relationships that is permanent it's as if some of you are trying to figure out if that's the direction you want to go in so I'm seeing a new start after marriages coming in um, a new start after the engine of marriages I see um, the energy of some of you having faith to move on um, I'm, I'm seeing some of you trying to figure out why a relationships um, never work and I'm seeing also um, some of you who were in relationship with the earth sign people um, that you have decided to hand this relationship for whatever it is okay so for the Aquarians some of you are ready for walking away from a marriage so let's see what this is all about so definitely some of you have entered a marriage and you're walking away um, you are trying to find this new start and this new start is definitely going to be coming in and there's a message for some of you who have kids not to worry because everything is going to be working out fine okay so the people who have left a marriage the marriage has ended divorce finalized um, you are understanding where this is now we have some of you having faith you are too open you're having faith but you're too open and there's definitely changes that is coming in so if some of you were hoping for a new relationship yes this is going to be happening so for the people who are single hoping for a new relationship yes it's a definitely definitely going to be happening um, then we have the situation where some of you are in limbo trying to figure out why a relationship didn't work out and it's because um, you know sometimes you get into relationship and you get into situations and now you're realizing um, that some relationship is only for a time so you're going to be receiving news you're going to be understanding that um, do not sit wandering let it go because it has ended it was not something to last for a lifetime it has just ended and you need to move on with your life okay so there and um, you could be receiving this message or the person is going to be letting you know why it didn't work out because it was not meant to 
Now, they're having um, the energies of the heart sign people in the reverse. So for the men and both women, and there was some deceptive situation that has played. There was some jealous and lies, deceptive situation that has played. So um, people who were releasing themselves from Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, obviously, there was some unjust situation that has played. You're gonna be receiving message from this also. And what is gonna be transpiring is that you're going to be ending this relationship. Some of you could have already ended the relationship and this is why these people are in the reverse form but there was some lies jealousy and deceitfulness um, that some of you have with these earth sign people okay so um, there we go these were energies that came out and uh, um, these energies that came out um, is really um, sometimes the universe um, um, wants to help you to understand certain issues in your life so you can move forward because some of you are holding fast on a relationship that no longer serve you okay some of you are definitely holding fast on a relationship that no longer serve you and you need to understand that relationship comes and go and um this relationship is just an end okay so you're ending this relationship so let's look at see we're looking at all four weeks what to expect in all four weeks and we have the energy of um, family um, the blonde and a short term relationship now I'm seeing the beauty queens you guys are going to be really having fun a lot of text messages control issues I'm seeing you ladies 45 years and older a lot of you are dating dating um, but you're going to be building constructive relationships, okay? Um, you young ladies, um, here is past life issues that is coming back. You young ladies are connecting with people from past life and they are overseas, okay? They're definitely overseas. Um, um, some of you have passion with someone and from this passion in this relationship, there is going to be a real long-term relationship that is going to be ended up in a union so let's say for by for um, for example you have um, been in a relationship with someone and what is transpiring is that this um, person um, basically um, you you were friends this relationship is going to be turning in a love relationship okay so um, expect that to happen I'm seeing a lot of you who are in passionate relationships or being very 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 um, or being um, like very um, possessive in this relationship you need to release yourself of this um, possessiveness so um, remember um, your outcomes from this month is union so a lot of you are going to be connecting um, in union in relationships so a lot of marriages a lot of people are going to be asking the answer of marriages um, and this is going to be good and this um, situation is that whatever deceptive and lies that is in your relationship it's all going to be coming out so be aware of this so let's go in and look at the first week um, and this first week can affect some of you Aquarians in the first week, but it can also affect you in an on the timeline in the month. Okay, so in the first week we have three energies: we have the family, we have the blondes, and we have short term. So we're going to be looking at the people, um, how your relationships affect your family, and the relationships. For blondes we're definitely going to be checking that out to see how that is going to be affecting you so we're going to be putting back the information that came out for you guys in the deck and then we are definitely going to be looking at the love relationship so let's see um, what is going to be coming out with the energy of the family Okay, so um, in 
the first week I see people trying to work on their relationship which is very good whatever is transpiring or whatever is happening in the first week a lot of people seems to be working on their relationship trying to bring stability in their relationships and this is going to be very very positive because stability is what is going to be affecting you guys so you're really trying to bring stability in your relationship which is um, very positive I'm sorry my hair is so not wet so okay let's look and see what's happening so we have the energy of family coming up here with the energy of family I'm seeing the worries is now over okay so some of you um, that a relationship didn't work out um, and you were worried about your family there is no reason to worry this is going to be okay what is transpiring and what is happening is basically um, that you're going to be finding balance um, even though situation seems to be so weird at this moment you're definitely going to be finding balance so for the people who your partner has left the relationships you will be okay all right it is just um, a time where you're going to be realizing that you are going to be balancing out the situation yourself okay so not to worry about um, this issue that you're worried because here it is that no need to worry because you will be okay just no need to worry because you will be okay all right so if your partner left you in your first week there is absolutely no need to worry you'll be okay um the in the relationship with the blondes is that you blondes or brunettes or so you are leaving yourself too open okay and um, some of you have had some conflicts in your relationships and now you have regained control of your relationship but you're leaving yourself um, too open and this is not um, good for you guys you're leaving yourself too open you're draining yourself this is not the right way to do it you need to have some you need to stand your ground you're letting your partner walk over you and you need to stand your ground okay so stand your ground um, you ladies short-term relationship is here and some of you ladies are having some short-term relationship but um, you're learning from these short-term relationship and this is good because you're finding out what it is that you like what it is that you don't like and this is really wonderful because what is transpiring is basically that you're trying to figure out who you are in the short-term relationship and you're trying to see what it is that I like in this person what it is that I don't like in this person and this is very good because um, you are understanding who you are okay it's a uh, it's understanding where you are who you are and um, understanding the other person and knowing exactly what it is that you really want in a relationship and this is just so wonderful and so positive so whatever um, is transpiring in your life with these short-term relationship they're just teaching you and helping you to understand uh, like um, who am I what am I looking for a relationship and what sort of a um, interest is coming into my life and this is really really positive so um, this is good because everything you're opening up the books you have no secrets you're opening up you have absolutely no secrets you're trying to find um, balance in your life to find out what relationship works for you what relationship doesn't works for you and this is um, so so positive so it's all about working on relationship it's all about you um, finding out who you are working on your relationship and finding inner strength um, figuring out who you are and what it is in a relationship that you want um, going forward and this is very very good especially for young people this is when you um, change your own partners to find out who it is and what it is that I want in a relationship so I'm loving this um, and this situation can affect um, anyone any time of the month so not to worry um, that it came up in the, the first week it can affect you in the third week fourth week fifth week that sort of an issue okay there's definitely new love that is coming in definitely 
um, new love that is coming in I'm seeing a lot of you are going to be finding true love in this month a lot of you it's going to be finding true love in this month okay so let's um, move forward and look at the second week to see um, what is coming up in the second week so remember the people who are having issues with your partner have moved on it is okay um, the lesson that you both should learn is over and now they're moving on and it's okay the second week we're dealing with the dating queens a lot of communication a lot of communication so some of you could be dating and there's a lot of communication that is coming up but it's as if someone is controlling you or you are controlling someone so let's take a look and see what is happening for you guys so first we have the dating queen and we have a lot of communication text message um, communicating um, via the um, different ways of communication we're seeing control issues that is coming up definitely issues um, control issues so someone could be um, you could be dating someone and they're trying to control you so be aware of this okay you could be dating someone and someone is trying to control you so I'm seeing yes new love that is coming in and this new love um, some of you have to make a decision about this person and this relationship okay but definitely um, you dating Queens new love is coming in and this is so positive control issues what does it has to do with the Aquarians control issues for the Aquarians um, some of you could be dealing with the, um, the king of cups whoever this king of cups could be married but yet still he's trying to control you guys okay so you could be dealing with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion that is married but yet still um, he is trying to control you guys so be aware of this because he's married to a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn he's definitely in a marriage some of you might know some of you might not know so as we look at the energy of the dating queen definitely some of you may have met someone new some of you have met someone new so you guys who are on the dating scene you have definitely met someone new but um, there could be multiple partners so you need to make a choice which one of these people um, whatever the choice is you really need to make a choice to find out which one of these people are viable and what is the best situation for you guys so um, definitely um, new love is here for you dating Queens and there are multiple um, people that is coming up now for communication um, there is a lot of you who have met someone there is a lot of communication that is going back and forth between you and this person and this is just so powerful because they are coming in strong and they have a message for you um, there is someone out there that someone that you're communicating with text message and that sort of a thing um, really wants to give you a message and this message is going to help you to understand that they are not joking they want to have a friendship and they want to have a marriage and a friendship with you um, it's as if this person know from the first time you guys met that you are the one and they are really trying it's not really that they're controlling but they're just really trying to figure out is do you feel the same way for me and this is why it's transpiring it's like they're saying you know there's a lot of communication you might think that it's being controlling but they want to really really know if you are the one then we have control whatever the control issues was or his is now over so in the past there was some control issues and this the control issues is now over it's as if some of you learn that by controlling a situation and this is it it's learning you have learned that by controlling a situation some of you could have had a controlling issue with uh, um, a cancer 
a cancer could have been controlling you for quite some time and now you are reversing yourself and you're releasing yourself of these control issues and this is going to be um, very positive and very good and um, this is just extremely wonderful so what I'm seeing with dating queens is that new love is coming in for you guys there is multiple partner multiple people to choose from I'm seeing that some of you definitely understand that because the energy that is here is that you realize you're you're realizing a lot of stuff a lot of information is coming out about who you are and dating and this is really positive um, as we look at control some of you were in a, a, a really controlling relationship and um, it could be that you were with in a relationship with someone who was controlling you who was a Pisces cancer or a Scorpio but this person is married um, he was um, very controlling but um, what is transpired is that this control issue is going to move away some of you are going to be receiving news that you have to make a decision because you're going to be finding out some information and this information is helping you and you are going to be making a decision okay so let's see what is going to be happening with this new love and the decisions a lot of you have to make decision new love and the decision um, there is a sort of a cloud over you guys okay there is sort of a cloud over you guys and and whatever it is is as if um there is a block um money is coming um so some of you could be controlled by a very rich man because um this man um is married but yet still he has this man is married but yet still he has um, a prominent life and he wants uh, he controls everything around him so it's not only you he's controlling he's very rich and this is the reason why because he wants to have his mistress and um, you know he gives you everything because he has money and what he wants is that whenever he calls that you're supposed to be there so and it's so it's a someone who's very possessive and has a lot of money so he wants he he has a mistress because he wants whenever he calls that you're there okay and money definitely money is money is not an issue money is um, whoever this person is that you're in a relationship with money is not an issue this is a businessman this this man wants to make sure that whatever is it that you need will definitely come to you money is definitely not an issue um, so it depends on what you're looking for in your relationship if you're one of these people who think okay um, you know I'm fine you know if you want to take care of me I'm fine I will you know be there whenever you need me then you won't see it as control but if you're someone who works and have a life and and you know then you will see it as control so it depends on how you look at it so um, but it's wonderful it's really someone and it's as if they realize that you're a little bit controlling but it's as if you give them energy or you energize them whenever they seize you and they they are so crazy for you okay so let's uh, move on and see um, what else is happening and these energies can affect just each and every one of you and it depends on it doesn't have to be in the second week it can be any 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 time in the in the month it depends on who you are and your energy vibration okay so um, uh, uh, let's look at um, the third week now in the third week we have the young ladies and you are going to be connecting with someone from a past life but this person is a long distance from you 
okay so you're connecting with someone in a past life but this person is um, a long distance from you okay maybe in another city another country um, another um, state you know so or another country so um, or it could be just around the block <laughs> but this is this is far away from you and this could be another city another state another city another state another country okay so this is coming up so what they're saying is that um, you young people are definitely going to be reconnecting with this person um, you have asked to reconnect with this person um, in this lifetime to share your life with them in the intimate space and this is what is going to be happening um, the angels of love is saying that there is the connection of soulmates and twin flame that is definitely going to be coming in so let's see what's coming up for the brown and the young ladies we have hope and faith in a relationship we have hope and faith going forward in past life we see people open up to reconnect with people from past life they're definitely open up um we see some of you are going to be um connecting um from um connecting with the night of the night of ones this is at um, a, a, um this is an aries leo or such targets so you're definitely going to be connecting with this person then we see the energy of the star that is coming up the energy of the star is that some people have full faith um there 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 has been situations in your relationships and you're trying to find faith but it is it's as if the fate is so hard to come by because you have been so hurt and whatever the hurt is and the pain is um you have been very hurt and it is hard for you to um regain balance to move that to make that shift so this is coming up in this month for the people who have lost relationships in the months before it can also a year and it is still affecting you you're trying to find hope to move forward but it's it's just not happening past life um issues there are um some of you who were hoping to hear from someone from the past life but um this news hasn't come in <coughs> you have opened up yourself to connect with this person but um it's you haven't received this news it's as if this news haven't come in you were hoping and wishing that you would have heard someone from a, a ex ex or like people from past life and um it's as if some of you want to heal a relationship but you haven't heard anything from this person now as we look at long distance relationships some of you are definitely going to be connecting um with and aries leo or sagittarian and um this person um, um was not focused on you because um they were married okay so some of you were in a long distance relationship with the knight of wands or um, an older man this is uh, um, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius but it's an older person and uh, um, they were focusing on something else because they um, were going through a divorce now the divorce is now over you can see the energy of the family so the divorce is now over and what is transpiring is that um, soon you might be hearing something from this person okay so so, so it's as if some of you have met someone um, um, who is living abroad or living in another city um, or another state and what is transpired is that you have met this person it felt good and everything but you have not had any connection in quite some time and you you know you kind of feel as if this person is not seeing someone else but there seems to be issues 
that is going on with this person yes there is issue that is going on with this person because they have a family and they were going through a divorce and that's the reason why you haven't heard from them but in the future you will hear from them okay so whoever that was dealing with um, and Aries Leo or Sagittarius um, this part no yeah and Aries Leo or Sagittarius this person um, they're not seeing anyone else it's just that they have been um, occupied with getting divorced okay there is some um, um, again um, you ladies was um, waiting to hear from a man um, someone of a past life he came out in the reverse that means um, the message or the connection or what you were um, what you were waiting and hoping for is not happening okay um, not right now it's as if the time isn't right for this connection okay so um, it's as if they need to work on whatever they need to work on the time isn't right for this connection some of you are really hurt by this man and you're trying to heal it could be that you men were also waiting for information from someone but it's not working I'm seeing um, whoever is with an older Aries Leo or Sagittarius they're going to be surprising you um, expect a surprise from this person um, because um, they know that you have been waiting for them and they're going to be surprising you because they're going to be like you know I really appreciate that you have um, you know spend the time not to go with someone and gave me the fate to, to give to and the time and space to you know finish my marriage and deal with whatever the situation is because their marriage is now over and um, they're they're definitely going to be returning to you and they're going to be surprising you because they're definitely going to be returning to you so I'm loving this for you guys as usual I wish I could show you the layout but it's a beautiful layout and um, sometimes um, um, you know we meet people and we cross part with people and um, you know people don't always say exactly what is going on in their lives and whosoever it is out there that you have met this person this person realized that they truly care for you and um, whatever the situation is is that they needed to resolve and end the situation with their um, marriage before they could have uh, reconnect with you and that was what has happened and transpired and they're going to be surprising you so a lot of you are going to be um, receiving surprises from your ex uh, surprises from people surprises from people who you thought uh, um, you know didn't really care um, you know unexpected like, people who you thought were checking out other people and that sort of a thing they weren't really they had issues that they had to deal with so this is the reason why you haven't heard from them okay so that's beautiful let's um, move forward and see um, what's coming up and remember that this 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 reading is based on a month reading not weekly but um, I do it in weeks to break it down so that we can see exactly what is going to be happening so these issues can connect please like share these videos and um, please like share these videos um, let other people know about this check out also your friends girlfriends send it to your friends and girlfriends these are free love readings so this is good okay so we have the energy of you guys coming up with friendship and passion okay so some of you who are in friendship it could become a passionate relationship so let's say that you were in a relationship some of you are going to be connected with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius um, woman okay um, you men are here and you are the, the ones who are going to be connecting with this person it's gonna be a lot of passion that is coming up 
I'm seeing a lot of you women could be going after the same sex okay so I'm seeing a lot of you women could be going after the same sex Wow yeah some of you women could be going after the same sex but you're going after an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius person okay you could be going after the same sex but it's an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius person I'm seeing a lot of you women and men are definitely um, people who you had uh, connected with as friendship I'm seeing you making that move and moving um, to the passion okay so and then after the passion is the union so it's as if you have been friends with someone for quite some time, and then all of a sudden a shift of energy where the relationship become passionate and then from the passionate then there is a union and it's as if this person was there your entire life and you weren't really realizing that this was the person for you because basically um, they have been you guys have been such close friends powerful friendships you guys have you have support each other with your relationships you know endings and beginning and that sort of a thing and now it's as if a shift of energy the passion comes out and you're going to be jumping in and go for the union afterwards but I'm saying the passion is so powerful and then you know you will realize this is the person I want to spend my life with and some of you were thinking oh my god you have been here my entire life and I haven't seen you until today and this is um, this is really powerful so it is definitely going to be wonderful for a lot of you where friendships are becoming lovers and it's going to become a positive positive unions okay so um, um, people are really sharing and connecting with each other um, you guys are going to be connecting in a love union where you're going to be opening up sharing um, your um, financial abundancy but also um, opening up your world to another person which is beautiful I have seen some deceptive move in relationships with you men there was some deceptive move <laughs> it could be on you have done it or the other person have done it I've seen a lot of passion that is coming up here a lot of passion um, you know and the passion is going to be just so powerful for you guys in this month a lot of passion for you ladies and gentlemen you're turning up in your region with a, lot, a whole lot of passion and this is going to be good so let me see the energy of this four of ones jumping in um, the ending of the Queen of Wands. So some of you who were in a relationship with an, um, some of you who were in relationship with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius person, there is an end to this lady. Whoever this lady is, um, it could be a lawyer. Um, there is an end to her. She has done something really, really deceptive. There is an end to her. She has definitely done something really, really deceptive. And there is an end to her. So she could be in a relationship um, with you men. And uh, it could be a relationship or a friendship. And she has done something very, very deceptive. And now um, it is coming to an end. Whoever this lady is, whatever she has done, she has done an injustice. Um, really deceptive really deceptive she has done something um, really deceptive and uh, um, it is now coming to an end and this is just so beautiful um, um, some of you who are in passionate relationship whatever the deceptiveness there was a theft that has transpired um, and and, and, and this is um, it's as if a relationship someone in a relationship has done something 
injustice and it has to do with this lady this lady is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius um, she could have been a friend that has become your enemy in some way but it was as if you had a strong bond with this person and this person has is very slime there was some slyness where this person wasn't saying exactly what was transpiring but it's come it has come to an end okay so really 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 um, a situation this situation is really bad so it's good that it came to an end so ladies and gentlemen I'm wishing you just a wonderful beautiful um, union um, whenever the energy of union comes up it is very positive because this is um, um, a love that is coming in powerful but it's also a relationship that is going to be lasting for a lifetime okay this union is going to be powerfully made and shifted and this is going to be um, so happening um, for you guys in a long lifetime namaste until next time